Welcome back to After the Whistle. I'm David Gibson. On this week of Chatting with the Champs, I speak with Bodnos Jaden McLeod on his record-breaking performance at the Carrington Golf Course. This is Jaden McLeod, your 2021 State Class B champion. He says that he was a late bloomer in the sport of golf. In seventh grade, he'd come over a lot until his mom got off work, and we'd go back into our football practice field and just chip and putt around. Uh, lots of practice, lots of balls, a lot of shanks. The fundamentals of golf taught to him by his friend. Jaden worked around the clock to improve his skills. Yeah, he's a he's a course rat. I, as soon as he as soon as he started golfing, he just fell in love with it, and then he just lives at the golf course in the summer. Um, any given day, he's he's up there from sunrise to sunset, working on his game, um, trying different things, and you know I just try and stay out of his way. He's just he's so good at. at um, you know, honing his swing and fixing things that, you know, he, he's just that talented. Yeah, it played a big role because practice, they say practice make perfect, but as close as you can, we can get to perfect. After having a strong regular season, Jaden qualified for the state tournament and head coach Nate Simpson reminded him to keep his eyes on the prize and stay mentally tough. Well, he knows what he's got to shoot and, and he's strong enough mentally to, to understand that one bad shot isn't going to define your round. Um, he had a double bogey on 11 on the back today and you know it could have gone one of two ways but you know he comes back on, on two holes later and has a tap in birdie. I mean the kid is, just had ice in his veins and nothing was going to rattle him. I knew there was a lot of good golfers out here today but I had total faith in him. I told him just keep your faith in himself so he did that and he executed to perfection. On day two of the state tournament, Jaden kept that confidence going, shooting a 29 through his first nine holes. I just said to myself, I'm feeling it. Got to keep this going. Oh my goodness, he was hotter than a pistol. It was so fun to watch uh, those first six holes when he was just birdie after birdie. I talked to him a little bit before the round and, you know, he just kind of said, go get it. Don't be afraid to go get it. And, and you know, he said he's going to shoot for pins and, and he did that and, and just played unreal. I've, I've never seen anything like it. After having a stellar first round, Jaden kept rolling, securing a state championship. It's amazing, even hitting that chip shot in front of all those people. It's just something I'll never forget. It's awesome. We're boys from day one, so it's huge. That's all. All, all year, um, we, we knew he was capable. He, he was kind of a, I don't know, I'll say a hidden gem in the state of Class B uh, golf. Uh, he, he didn't maybe get the recognition that, or, or notice, I guess, that, that some other golfers got. But we always knew he was, he was good and he could, he could go low and, and win this thing. And that was his goal. He wanted to win it coming in. There was nothing else he wanted to do. But it didn't just stop at individual accomplishments. Jaden helped his team finish third overall in the state. Oh, I'm feeling pretty great. I knew what I had to do coming into this day and got it done. Consistency played a big role. That was probably one of the main points. We just needed to stick together mentally and physically. I had a bad round today, but my teammates lifted it up, so it's, it's huge that we all just came together and worked good. Kids came out, all six of them, and they just came out and they performed way above expectations over a two-day tournament. So I'm, I'm really excited and happy for the kids to uh, set a goal and accomplish it. Congratulations again to Jaden and the Bodno Braves on a great season. We'll have more after the whistle after.